All right. I'm playing with lighting. I hope this is a little bit better than usual. Um, it keeps going into auto night detection because the regular lights in my room are so yellow. I have a little LED light over here, but I'm guessing it's not strong enough. The test photo I did was pretty decent. Anyway, this is a, just a quick little uh, haul video I wasn't planning on doing. Um, I don't usually go out specifically looking for after Christmas sales, but I bought a few things today while I was out and about to pick up uh, my secret Santa gift for work. Um, person I picked is a young teenage boy gamer, which is a little vague. So I wasn't quite sure what to get, um, but I did finally narrow it down. Um, so anyway, I was at Walmart. Everything from Christmas is 75% uh, off. So this whole bag I managed to pay less than $5 for. Um, as you saw, I do like to do decorating cookies and, I don't know, little things like that. I don't do it all the time, but I like to do it at the holidays. So... These little snowflake gift tags I'm going to use as one of my, uh, actually it's not even a gift tag, but I'm going to use it as a decoration after I wrap uh, Kieran's present. Um, got this icing. Um, it's candy cane flavored. It's the only reason I had to pick it up because obviously I can get white anywhere, anytime. Um, I do have candy cane flavored sprinkles. And I have cinnamon flavored sprinkles. I don't think I used any of those this year. Um, I was in a hurry. I wasn't prepared. I made them last minute, so I didn't go crazy. And in fact, this is actually cupcake icing, cake icing. Siggy, stop shaking the bed. Um, so it won't set up as quick as the cookie icing. Maybe I'll make cupcakes next year. And just use and the other things I got on them. I got these little candy shreds. I don't know if that's going to focus or not, um, but I like how they look like snow. So maybe I'll just do cupcakes that look like snow and then maybe find a uh, one of those candy molds in the shape of a snowflake. Or Jason and I are thinking of playing with that uh, make your own silicone mold recipe where you just use stuff you can get at Home Depot. Um, so maybe I'll make my own snowflake chocolate mold. Um, I got this. I think it was 27 cents or something. I have a few of these uh, that came with a little extra piece I bought in North Carolina. I think I have a candy cane one with a bow, a snowman with a top hat, and a snowflake with an extra snowflake. I don't remember. But I couldn't remember if I had this one. It was the only one. And even if I do, it cost me next to nothing. So... And last but not least, instead of always using the silver dragees or the cinnamon candies, I got this little bag of Wilton mini sugar candies. Um, 30 cents I think these cost me. I don't even remember. Um, but I thought these would look cute on the Christmas trees. This was the only bag of multicolored left. The rest of them were red, green, and white. Which I already have enough red, green, and white stuff. So that's that, and that was going to be that, but then I stopped at Dollar General to pick up some foil, because I was going to do some photography today, because it's raining. I'm going to try to find some interesting inspiration to do some rainy photos. I never did. I don't know. I feel like for once sitting home and doing nothing on my day off. But Dollar General has 50% off their Christmas stuff, and our store was kind of boring this year at work. We didn't decorate at all. Uh, a couple of stores did. So, I had seen these the last couple days. They look like little lights. Um, this one has the regular red and green and silver, as well as a couple of these dark blue, almost purple, and a couple of these hot pinks. Um, there was another set that was all modern colors. They were like pinks, lime greens, purples. Um, I kind of like this regular traditional color ones better. Um, so these were 50 cents. These are also 50 cents. Uh, they're just little foam packages. Ornaments look like love gift packages. 
I thought maybe if we just strung them off counter or set them on the registers by counter. I don't know. They didn't cost me anything. They're cute. And then I went ahead and went with these. Because they did have little baby ornaments like this for 50 cents. But since this whole thing was $1.50. So 8, 9, 10, 11, 14, 24. Oh, duh. It's 24 count on the front. I guess I should read. Um, anyway, this little plastic ornaments. Um, figured it'd be enough to make the store look cheerful. Uh, they did have some ribbon um, in plaid and candy cane stripe. Um, it's still a little too expensive for me to pay right now. Half price would be two dollars. If it goes to 75% soon I may buy it just to make bows or something. And this I bought for myself. Printed tape for a dollar. I have a couple of these from a few years ago back when they weren't doing many of these scotch tapes. Um, the one I have is clear with gold snowflakes, gold and white snowflakes. I'm almost out of it. I don't want to use it because it's so cute. Um, but I bought this with a little holly and ivy. Um, probably stick it in with the rest of the uh, wrapping paper. So that's that. Um, do Betty want to show you my Secret Santa gift? I know Karen won't ever watch this, and I'm sure he won't watch it between now and next weekend. But um, not only does he game, but he also plays tennis. So what do you get a 17-year-old tennis player? Um, and I don't do gift cards. I think they're impersonal. So I found these on Etsy last night. They are old patent drawings. Uh, patents for tennis racket. And you could pick a few different background colors. I like this chalkboard. I thought it was cute. Um, tennis ball. And I put him in these sleeves to protect him until he can put him in a frame. But how cool is that? It has all the info and stuff. I did those in 8x10 because it only costs a couple bucks to have those printed at Walmart. Um, we did have a budget of 10 to 20 I didn't want to go over. Plus I really didn't have it to spend. So I didn't buy frames. I figured he could buy whatever frames he wanted. But then I went ahead and spent a couple extra dollars to do this in 11 by 14 And this is the patent of the net the tennis net so I hope he appreciates them um, they're a little bit off the uh, norm but that's what I do I try to find something that I think people will really like and be like oh, I never would have thought of that or that's really cool but yet not spend a whole lot of money at the same time so I'm gonna mount this onto a little piece of cardboard so it's it lies flat and then I'm just going to wrap them together and stick them in the Secret Santa box tomorrow. He doesn't work again until the weekend. He won't get it till then. But hopefully he will appreciate them at the very least. So anyway, that's enough for this mini hurl. This is one video. There's going to be no editing, splicing, probably. I don't need to stitch a bunch of videos together. Sorry if it's a little jiggly. Um, the camera is setting on a stand on my bed. I'm trying not to move. Although Sigby keeps moving. So, until next time. Bye.